I like to think extremely. <laughs> Building blocked. I really hope there's no traps in this, uh... This little bushes shit outside the house. But if there were traps, they probably would have decayed. Oh, man. That's such an easy, uh... An easy thing to get through. If I brought back one C4... Hmm... I could sit here and bang on it with, uh, hat hatchets until it opens up. But it's really, really near the main highway. So I hesitate to do so. Especially if somebody shows back up and they're like, is this your house? Fuck no it ain't, Sunny Jim. <clears throat> hmm. But I do want to know what's inside. And I did say we'd get into some trouble today. Hmm. Yeah, I think 2C4 could take down this wall. But then where would I be in the base? Therein lies the question. Alright. I'll just chop a little wood. We'll make a few hatchets. We'll fucking try and bust that door in. And if we die doing so, then it was a good run. It's gonna take me just a little while to, uh to get in there, so we'll probably have to do some fast editing or some such. But that's alright. We'll get in there, or die trying. <laughs> Cut to either of those. <laughs> but the most riveting moment is when you break down that door and you see the goodies that lie beyond. It might just be another door or two, but we'll never know until we try. I think I'm gonna have to make one more stone axe in order to be able to get through this fucking thing. Boo! And, uh, there's probably a littering of axes. Nope. They just, uh, sink into the grass and go away forever. It takes so long for frags to cook in this fucking thing. There are servers that have, uh, quicker smelt times and such. And I think that's probably not a bad idea. Whatever. I make a hatchet. We gonna get in there, I'll tell you what, boys. Ow! I hope it's not just another door. I hope it's, like, wide open as shit in there. But, uh, we'll find out how much work they done. Oh, yes. Three, two, oh, beyond the door, Dayton does, gonna see what for, oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do this. But what I am gonna do... There's a fucking bear. Leave me alone, bear. <sighs> My heart jumped so hard. I thought it was a person that caught me inside of their house. Damn, dude, of course it's another door. Why wouldn't you put at least one other door? Shit. It's alright, I'll take my things. I'll be on my way then. So disappointing. Oh well. Let's make some gunpowder. We could definitely make some gunpowder. Do 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 do. Yeah, that'll use all my sulfur mostly. Hmm. And I gotta remember where this is on the map. It's not exactly secret, but I might want to be back. Come back to this someday. Some D. Hashtag harvest hemp. <laughs> yeah! I'm behind this hashtag. <laughs> Man. I need my, my map. I don't know what direction I'm headed. South is about right. Southeast, a little bit better. Uh oh. It's an airdrop. I hear it. 
I don't want to have to shoot somebody for it. Did he drop it yet? Did he drop it yet? Did he drop it yet? Hey, dang, did you drop it yet? I think that's like the beginning of the map. If you could drop it right now, that would be fucking great. Do it. Did you do it? You didn't do it. <laughs> drop it! Drop it! No, it's going way north. <clears throat> I did leave a furnace behind that guy's house, so uh, if I decide to come back, we could probably get into some more shenanigans. Shenanigans! Did not drop yet. Everybody's got eyes on it. Hmm, apparently I'm not the only one watching it. This makes me quite uncomfortable. I'll throw this hatchet away. That is a shame. I kind of knew in my heart that uh, nobody would just leave a building like that, but you never know. So, why not? Always 30 minutes and a few resources. Fuck it, I say. <laughs> I should bring some resources back, though. So that I didn't waste an entire trip. Can get some more wood. Wood probably being the most important resource that there is. Because you just dump it in the fires. You smelt things up. I also really like animal fat. Because we could get that uh, mining machine running. Which I think would be super cool. There's also a crude oil machine. And you can end up if you uh, get the crude oil and refine it. Although it does take animal fat to get the crude oil. You end up with more animal fat than you started with. I think it's about 20% more. Which isn't that much. But uh, it's a decent exchange for nothing. Except, you know, a time investment. Not bad. Really, uh, wood's probably the most important resource that there is. Everybody likes wood, don't they? Keep hearing things in my headphones. <laughs> is it a bear? I hope it's not a bear. The animals do have, uh, different sounds, as do the people, which I think is really cool. You can kind of tell what's walking outside your house if you, uh, are attuned to nature. Oh, yeah. I think I got a pretty good amount of wood. Yeah, we're going into our uh, fourth stack here. So that's going to be nice. If I see any uh, rocks on the way home, I'll hit I'll hit any rock. Um, but the only ones that I'll break down into nothing are the sulfur. Jeez, I keep hearing my own footsteps. <laughs> it's really freaking me out, bro. I'd really like to uh, avoid the helicopter if I'm able to as well. He is not a friendly man. He is not a friendly man. Alright, so we can swoop around this mountain ridge. And then I should be basically back to, uh, back to the base again. We didn't go to the train yard or anything. I ended up in the military base due to a stray airdrop. Oh god. Leave me alone, bear. <laughs> Don't come over this way, bear! Hmm. Everybody's got their little crews. Everybody's banded together in groups of two or three. Which I think uh, makes for an extremely interesting game. Yes. Especially since I'm out here farming by myself. It's probably not the, uh, the wisest idea that I've ever had. But that uh, other dude was out here by himself too. Otherwise, I probably would have got fucking marked. Two dudes with ch Thompsons chasing me down. Um, yeah, that's not good. That's not good. Overall, I think we came away uh, extremely well today. I would have been pissed if we got into that building and then got killed for nothing. But since we uh, spent some time breaking down the door, I ain't too mad. I wasted some uh, stones and some animal fat, but it's like whatever. Whatever, that thing's out there now. I can go back and use that furnace anytime. If I had an extra door, I would definitely, um, slap it on there with the code lock just to kind of troll. <laughs> but I really think that that's just like a, a decoy house or something like that. 
kind of like what I have set up near the airfield, where it's like, if you want to break into this, you can, but there's really not that much inside of it. Maybe some blueprints, maybe some treats, but, uh, not too hopeful, all things considered. I've been doing some running, man. Fucking starving. Starving, Marvin. I gotta break up this rock, kid. I think this is just a stone. I don't want stones. I want sulfur. They're colored strangely. Here's some wood. Wood. Metal ore. Ore. What's it good for? For not much till you smelt it. It's metal ore. I know you're gonna belt it. In your mouth. Don't belt yourself in the mouth with metal unless you need braces. This song's horrible. This is the worst song I've ever heard. There. High quality metal ore. Boom. Boom. I want sulfur more than anything else though because I'm uh... I'm up to some shenanigans recently. Breaking into people's hooses. Hey, what's going on in here? You guys having a party? You didn't invite me. I think this is just another stone too. The uh, the sulfur nodes are like extremely vibrant, and I keep getting tricked by uh, these dingy rocks. Disgusting dingy rocks. I'm really shocked that uh, I hit that guy near the airdrop. I guess my target practice on animals has been <laughs> doing some good at the very least. This is not a sulfur rock either. I remember in original Rust where there were just um, certain certain types of metal nodes, certain types of stone nodes, so you knew what you were getting. And I think that's a little better. It works for Hurt World extremely well. And uh, yeah, I don't know why they decided to do it differently here. I guess they just wanted to load you down with stones, make it a... Uh, inventory management kind of thing which it always kind of was but you have too much inventory back at your base and not enough on your person or your belt actually I think the belt is about right six slots is uh, plenty of inventory if you ask me but nobody does and I don't blame them one bit <laughs> 800 bonus on this mining I've been doing quite a bit of mining it should be well, no, not almost back home. We need to pass the airfield still. And now it's going to be night, so uh, I don't really want to turn on my, my helmet. Helmet hat light thing. Give me more high quality metal. High quality metal. Big high quality metal. Oh, yeah. There it is. Deep within the rock. We had to dig deeply. Oh, yeah. Give me that sulfur. I like that sulfur. I want more sulfur. Okay, at least high quality metal. There we go. <laughs> That'll do just fine. Smack some more rocks. Head on down. Yeah. We're just relaxing. We're just, we're just having some funsies. Whoa. Thought I heard a helicopter. Think it was a bullfrog. Could have been a machine gun very far off in the distance as well. Your mind just roams when you're uh, able to just rust. Sit here and rust and your mind goes crazy. Oh no. Little do they know my mind's been crazy for a long time. Jeez. I don't know why we decided to live so far out in the boonies. I guess it's because we can have a bunch of shit outside. Not worry about stone barricades. Nobody really comes by to uh, dig through my furnace, <laughs> even though there's no walls. That's reassuring. Oh my god, sulfur ore on the ground? Here, eat this. I knew we were saving that for a reason. I need my sulfur! God damn it! More than anything else, you give me sulfur. You give me sulfur. And really the best way to do it is probably to just run around and pick up those little tiny stones that you see that's how I do it on more high pop servers um, because you don't really want to stand around just like that guy that was standing around at the airdrop I wonder if I almost killed him I wonder how close I was 
I like to think extremely. Because I've been practicing. I've been practicing up. There's some metal here. What is that? Metal ore. Ugh. Throw this on the floor. Get the metal. We need metal more than stupid raw chicken. Don't ever throw the fat away. Hmm, so many sounds at night. <laughs> All these night sounds in my ears. Oh, and now we're fucking full. Full stones. Um, I guess throw charcoal away. I don't know. God damn it. Jesus. <laughs> Keep hearing things. High quality ore, sulfur ore, a little more sulfur. Yeah, maybe there's a, a more complex thing to the rocks that I don't completely get yet. But I do know that <clears throat> each one has one tap of high quality ore within it. So I definitely want to get that. I want to get that nine each. Nine here, nine there. Before you know it, you're fucking loaded up. Loaded up! How many we got? 321. Yeah, that's pretty loaded up. I think our base has like a total of 700, which means we can armor a lot more things. Which I, I should probably sit down and do. Dedicate some time to, but I just have such a good time running around in the world of rust. The world of rust. Alright, I gotta swim. I love to swim. Hooray. <clears throat> oh, it's not too deep here. Here it is. Can't see anything. Hmm. Can't seem to uh, turn my hat on in the water either. Which I guess makes sense. It's a miner's hat. Um... But it runs off of low quality animal fat, so I assume there is like some source of ignition instead of just being electrical. Even though it does look extremely electrical when it's being shown on the ground. Maybe I will just, yeah, clip it on for a minute. Just a minute. That wasn't a minute. <laughs> that was far short of a minute, Dayton. Whatever. I just want that high quality metal. That high quality metal. A little more sulfur. There was a rock over there. A rock! <laughs> yeah, I just kind of run around like a chicken with my head cut off, I guess. Lots of, lots of uh, stones in that one. I want high quality. High quality! I need to head a little more eastwardly. So I don't miss my base. Although, if I went down through the bottom, I'd probably be just fine. Follow the coast, basically, and you'll run into the, our base. But uh, most people won't go that far off the beaten path. I don't think. I'm sure there have been some people that uh, have poked around the base just a little bit, but... That's alright. Just don't hit it with uh, a mallet, or I'll come after you. <laughs> like, hey, what you doing? Hit, hit my house? Don't hit my fucking house. I live here, don't you know? <laughs> and then they didn't know, but they'll find out pretty fucking quick. We've been having some target practice. I made my cool reactive targets. I should make more of those. I'd like to make just like a whole field of them. Aww. Stones already? Well, whatever. I'm headed home anyways. I guess I'll just do what it do. And hopefully the helicopter doesn't pop up out of nowhere. That would be really nice. Just gotta pick up these, uh, these little things as I see them, I guess. Oh, up the hill? Really? What are you doing, horse? What the fuck are you doing? Is 
Did he run away? Is he gone forever? My horsey friend. My horsey friend. Oh. Guess not. <laughs> He's dead. Never mind. <laughs> yep, cloth, leather, animal fat. I don't care about your chicken breasts. I don't care about your chicken breasts. We can do this one too. Hey, piggy. That'll work. That'll work just fine. Hope I'm not attracting too much attention. Perhaps the person that I uh, clocked off on before <laughs> is lurking out there. But I hope not. And even if he is, I'm prepared. Oh my god. Why too cold? I'm apparently 100% wet? What the fuck? Dude, that's so awful. I hope I can at least make it back to my, my fucking hidey hole. <clears throat> I can at least respawn in my hidey hole. And, uh, come on back through. Jesus. What the fuck? Do I need to make a campfire or something? Is that what I'm missing? Alright, I gotta try a campfire, I guess, because this is, this is not going well. This is not going well. Throw that on the floor. Craft this up. Do now, do now. Light it. Oh yeah. Had to get rid of my cold. Damn, I guess it really does do something. I was in the water for too long or some such. Fuck. That really sucks. I used up all my med kits. Ugh, not good. Alright, at least I'm dry now. Fart. Fart dick! Dingleberry! <laughs> I'll get this. I get this. I want some metal. Metal! Metal till you die! I don't care about the stones. I just don't. Continue walking along the beach. You take a little peek. Anybody out there? Definitely somebody out there. Because they've been uh exploiting my my resources. Did you see the little bags? You think they're still out there? You think I should try and fucking mark them? Ooh. I heard of something. Really, I have no health left and no health kits, so I don't want to get into any shit. Unless... Unless I know I can kill him fucking straight out. I don't even see anybody. There's a couple cans on the far side, it looks like. Which might mean that it's uh, respawning. Yeah, they didn't clear it out very well. Here's some stuff. Might also mean that they're uh, in progress of clearing it out. Which means I don't want to stick around for too long. No, sir. Sulfur. Mm, sulfur. Delicious sulfur. Oh, it's good. That was quite an adventure. Mm-hmm. I'll be glad to see my hoose again. That's for damn sure. But uh, We did get... A relatively large amount of resources, which I think is important. Not that it's uh, really lacking around here. Just look at all these goodies. I don't know that anybody comes out this way. Hit the warehouse and then they're like, alright, see ya. Especially because there's a map. If it was old rust, legacy rust, I think things might be a little bit different. But uh, at the moment, yeah. Meh. It's all good. People clear that uh clear that madness and then they they walk on. 
At least that's what I like to think. <laughs> I hope nobody been down here at my house. Look at that prancing horse. Whoa. Uh, Woof. Yeah, it's pretty good. Waste more bullets than I need to, but damn, it feels good. I really do enjoy myself. Mm-hmm. And it's good for when the people come. The people. You know about them? Good. <clears throat> Don't ask me about it. Mm -mm -mm. Need more eastwardly. Eastwardly. I'm also getting hungry again. I need to sit down, craft up some med kits, uh, get to work on my base, etc., etc. I think this would behoove me. Yes. Hmm. I wonder if there's anybody down in my in my crevasse. Really, it would be so easy to block this whole thing off. I think uh, that's something that I'll work on. It seems like a good idea, maybe, but I really would like to uh, <clears throat> invite some people to walk down it, as it were, just so I can get the, the nice early jump on them. And really, that's what a lot of this game depends on. Who sees who first? And then, who gives up the surprise? How do they give it up? The fight can be won just like that. But yeah, if you come around this corner, it's uh, pretty hard to miss the fucking base. <laughs> Which is why I try not to leave too much stuff outside, but... The metal ore and stuff, yeah, it's it's fine. Although my furnace is off. Ooh. I'm inclined to build at least like a little enclosure around this furnace because I seem to be using it a whole shit ton of a lot. <laughs> mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Might be a good idea. There's so much metal in there. Holy fuck. I might as well just pull, like, a couple of them out. Stash them for later. Because I don't want to get completely fucked if we, uh... If we get completely fucked. I don't want to get completely fucked if we get completely fucked. But we might get completely fucked. So you better watch out. You better not cry. You better not out. I'm telling you why. There. Lots of fucking wood. Lots of wood. Hmm. Kings of this server, better recognize. Did I see a a dent somewhere? What? What? How did this happen? Somebody threw a grenade. Perhaps. Hmm. That's a little troubling. I'm gonna go drop a uh, a bunch of shit off. Actually, I could just leave it right here. This is at least a little bit safer. <laughs> there it is. Dump it off. I'll be ready for uh, for some more a little bit later. Gotta let them ores cook up. Uh, really, I'm just trying to stack a bunch of C4, like 30 C4, and then we'll go on a little raid, and I think that'll be about it for this uh, server series of Rust. I'll probably do another Rust series on something a bit more populated, because uh, there are a few people around here, but I definitely want, you know, every episode to feature a fight, although that might get a little bit frustrating. 
Dayton dies every episode. I hate watching it. <laughs> so I hope you guys let me know what you think. Definitely like, comment, and or subscribe. If you did enjoy the episode, I have been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. If you do like, comment, and or subscribe, I will send you some absolute vodka. It ain't the best, but it's pretty good. It'll get you drunk. <laughs> I hope to see you in the next one, friends. And until then, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friend.